Hello. Hello. This is a nice place. Yeah. I just kind of stumbled upon it. But the flowers are pretty and the view is wonderful. Yet, it feels sad here too. How come? The sea. It feels like the sea is crying. Stella, thank you for saving everyone. Because of you, the war is over, and no one has to die anymore. Thank you so, so much. It's sad when you lose someone you care about. I was really sad too when my mom died. It felt like there was a hole in my heart. Harriet. Hey! Pull yourself together. If you keep moping, Stella's gonna laugh at you. I'm not moping. Well, all right then. Let's go. Where? To that guy's house. He said he wants to see you. Who does he think he is anyway, ordering me around like this? You two really should make up. I heard you aren't even living together. I could never call someone like that my father. All right, well, let's get going to Will's house.
I'm sorry to bother you like this. What is it? We've all received medals from the Holy Kingdom of Ghidoria. Could you deliver them to everyone? All right, I'll be back. If you don't find someone in the town, just bring their medal back to me.
Well, how about it? Um, I'm afraid that's not going to work. Come on, I'll give you a discount. This is one deal you don't want to miss. I've got my livelihood to worry about here. If my family were to find out... Man, you just have to do it so no one finds out. Norma, what are you discussing? Oh, brother. Senny, Hattie, Hiya! Norma, cut it out! What? Norma, please stop pestering me. I can't just rent you a room indefinitely. What? No, I mean, renting out the room is fine. But you have to pay for it. I said I'd give you a discount. Norma, that's supposed to be my line. Oh, it's just a normal conversation. Normal? I'm one of the heroes who saved the legacy, right? You can at least give me a break on a room. But still, five gold a month. That's a little... Norma, all you're doing is harassing him. A medal, huh? Hmm, there's something mixed in with this. I'd say it's only about 70% gold. Norma, I heard you're searching for that ever something or other again. Yeah, the Everlight. I swear I'm gonna find it. So come on, Senny, give me a hand. Why me? Because Cheryl's brooch turned out to be a bust. It wasn't the Everlight after all. You owe me big time for all the work I did trying to get a hold of it. Okay, that makes absolutely no sense.
Chloe. A medal? I'm not worthy of such an honor. Chloe, are you feeling bad or something? Oh, because I came out of the hospital? No, I'm fine. I was inquiring about renting a room. Stingle is still on board somewhere. He has to be, and I will find him. Coolidge, are you all right? What do you mean? What, what else? You know. I guess I still have a ways to go if I'm making people worry about me. Of course I'm worried about you. What? Mm, nothing. A medal? Chaba! Go put this on your cat or something. Is that all right? <laughs> Senel, thanks for everything you've done for Moses. I can't even begin to express my gratitude. You even provided us with a place to camp. You really should be thanking Will and Isabella. They're the ones who arranged for that. Of course, when you stop and think about everything I've done, it's hardly surprising to be getting something like this. Well, now that we took care of Vaklov, it's time I got back to looking for my sacred heirs. Moses, stop bragging. I'm glad you and the others were okay, Chaba. Your wounds have healed already? Thanks to that medicine the masked swordsman gave us, Masked Swordsman? Stingle? We lost to Cashel in the Forest of No Return, and we're on the verge of death, but that Masked Swordsman came and saved us. I know he and Chloe got some bad blood, but he don't strike me as such a bad guy. Is Chloe looking for him? 
Probably. Oh well. Guess we'll cross that bridge when we come. You sure are laid back. The only way to be, hun. Thank <laughs> you. 